my friends. Today's book is Pink Lion by Jane Porter. Arnold's got four paws, whiskers and a curly mane. But is he really a lion? He doesn't think he'll ever be able to run and roar like his fierce friends until an unwelcome visitor changes his mind. A funny and exuberant tale about finding out who you really are. Enjoy. Pink Lion. Arnold's life was just right. His family loved him. They ate the nicest food and every day they played games down at the water hole. One day, a growling gang bounced by. It's a pink lion, they said, living with a lot of birds. What's he doing here? He's supposed to be part of our family. I'm a lion, asked Arnold, puzzled. Yes, look at your face in the water, said one of the lions. It was true. They did look alike. They had the same curly hair and whiskers. Could they really be related? Come along with us, said the lions. You should be out roaring and hunting. Arnold thought perhaps he should give it a try. This is how we hunt, said the lions, and off they raced. Arnold wasn't sure he could run that fast. Next, some washing, said the lions. It's easy, just stick out your tongue and lick. Lick, lick, lick. Arnold wasn't used to the furry taste, and he wished he had a soap and sponge. Being a lion was very different from life at home. Now let's roar, said the lions. All you do is open wide and let it out. <laughs> Squirk, said Arnold. I'm sorry, he said. You've been very kind, but I just can't do it. I'm not a proper lion. I think I'll go back to my family now. But when he got home, something terrible had happened. A very nasty crocodile had moved in. Excuse me, said Arnold. This is our water hole. Not anymore, said the crocodile. It's time you and your feathery friends move on. I live here now. Arnold didn't know what to say. He looked at the sky. He looked at the ground. And then a strange feeling like a hairy ball rose up from deep inside him. and burst out of his mouth with a mighty <laughs> The other lions heard Arnold calling. Together they chased that crocodile until he wished he had never seen the water hole. <laughs> and Arnold's roar was the loudest and fiercest of all. After that, life for Arnold went back to being just right again, and bath time with his new cousins was more fun than ever. Thank you, friends. I enjoyed reading Pink Lion. May you always be proud of where you came from. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to Miss Dana's channel. Bye friends and see you soon.